On behalf of the government and people of Nigeria, let me start by welcoming you back home after six years of meritorious service as the helm of affairs as the fourth OPEC Secretary General from Nigeria. You have indeed been a worthy ambassador of our country. We are proud of your achievements before enduring your appointment at OPEC and the proud legacies you will leave behind. Your time in charge of affairs of OPEC has been a very challenging time for the global oil industry. Oil producers were finding it difficult to come together to address the challenges that was crippling the oil market. Not long after the world was faced with the coronavirus pandemic, that sent crude oil prices spiraling down at an alarming rate. You showed incredible leadership to really industry players and push through the turbulent times. There is no doubt that your efforts in putting together the Declaration of Cooperation, which is the largest in the history of OPEC, and the global oil industry, and also the longest in duration in the history of the organization. This was a Herculean task. You have given experience administrative management to OPEC in the first six years, and your efforts have placed the organization in a stronger position to confront the challenges it will face in the coming years. The government and people of Nigeria are indeed proud of you and your achievements. I have directed the Ministry of Petroleum Resources and the LNPC to mobilize the Nigerian oil and gas industry to organize a befitting welcome reception in your honor. Posterity will remember the Secretary will remember you kindly. You have done yourself and your country proud. Once again, welcome home, and I thank you for the visit.